Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Dreamcatcher Meera. Today is a special day. Yes, it is Diwali, the most awaiting day for us to celebrate with fires and crackers. So happy Diwali to all the viewers and thank you very much for supporting me and being my backbone. So, and a happy new and a prosperous year. So wish you all the good luck in the coming new years. This video is a special video. I am beginning a Regensburg series. This is a city in the Bavaria state and it starts with this special event in this city. So stay tuned, watch this video till the end and don't forget to like, share and subscribe because this is a really special series. So keep watching Dreamcatcher Mira. <laughs> So my dear viewers, have you been to Regensburg? If no, I am going to take you through this beautiful medieval city of Germany. So stay tuned and watch this complete vlog series of Regensburg. Before talking about the city, in this video I am going to take you to the interesting event happening in Regensburg which I heard and saw for the first time. By the end of this video, let me know in the comment section if this event was also new to you and if you have already seen it then do mention in which city you have seen it. everyone I am in Regensburg and I am going to a special event this event is called Vino Kilo I don't know if you know about it but it is one of the famous events in Europe it takes place in different parts of the cities all around Europe and this time or on this day it is in Regensburg so I'm taking you to this place and let's see what we find over there I was a guest to this event, that's why I did not have to pay the entrance fee which was 3 euros. And for that, my hearty thanks to the entire team of Vino Kilo, also for allowing me to film this event. Vintage Kilo – Sustainable Fashion at Affordable Price the name itself says Vintage Kilo Sale and not a flea market which you can clearly see on its banner. After getting an event stamp, I entered the hall where numerous colorful second-hand clothes fill every corner of the Vino Kilo event so that the visitors can conveniently go through and browse everywhere. The effect of the cozy atmosphere is enhanced with a good music and delicious wine. Kilo is able to inspire their visitor with the concept, we just try to spend some vintage love. The most special thing about the second hand sale is that the price is on per kilo basis, that is 35 euros per kilo. And with this concept, we know Kilo wants to make vintage fashion accessible to everyone. The volunteers of the event constantly refills the stuff which includes jackets, skirts, shirts, tops, jeans and shorts so that new finds can be conquered at any time. This also includes leather purse and belts. And yeah, how can I forget this vintage jewellery? This lady came up with her collection for this vintage jewellery sale. Wow. 
Vino Kilo is a business that sells second hand clothes for an affordable price. They have sold around 81,000 cages of clothes in last two and a half years, says Robin Balzar with a German and Indian origin, who is the founder and the CEO of Vino Kilo, who first started this in Mainz, a city in Germany in the year 2016. He started with pop-up events and now they have 70 of those per year which takes place at the following countries like Germany, Luxembourg, Austria, Norway, Denmark and Netherlands. Other than that, they also run their online store. The link is given up for that in the description. Uh, okay. so, hello. Hi, my name is Mira. Hi, Cosima. Yes, so I'm running a YouTube channel called Dream Culture Vino. I've just recently started it. And this is my first experience over here in Vino Kino, a vintage shopping there. Have you been before over here? Uh, it's my first time. First, and yours? Me too. Uh, first time. First time. Same. <laughs> okay. Uh, but uh, do you know the concept? What is it about? Uh, not really. No, I think it's just that you buy something, what's second hand, and you don't. Buy something new and yeah. But uh, do you think the this, Okay. Uh, so do you is it, uh, do you think that if this process is good for recycling that the people don't want to use it rather than throwing them? They uh, the people uh, like us uh, can utilize it just buy it on a cheap rate. Is it a good process? Yeah, I think so. Okay. And uh, is this is uh, Vino Kino? Is this first time in Regensburg, or was it before also? Do you have any idea about it? So uh, we are not originally from Regensburg, uh, so okay. because of this, I we don't know. <laughs> okay, you they have, but they have a lot of second-hand shops like through Regensburg. There are many. Like, many I think, and uh, you don't have any kind of problem buying second-hand? No, 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 not at all. Not at all. Uh, because you buy a lot of things and then you throw it away and with uh, second hand you can use uh, clothes many years yeah no, it exactly. doesn't matter like it doesn't matter. if I like something I buy it okay. I don't care what time it is okay so it's just about according to your likes if you like it you yeah. buy it and if yeah. you don't like you don't buy it yeah okay then thank you very much yes. uh, and happy shopping yes. <laughs> thank you thank you bye bye, -bye. bye. According to a study that I came across in internet while researching about this event done by Greenpeace shows that German consumers buy on an average 60 garments per year. Isn't it a big number? It is, right? But every fifth garment is almost never worn. Every year, more than 80 billion pieces of clothing are newly produced, for which vast amount of water is consumed. There are also hundreds of health and environmental hazards chemicals used behind this clothes. Vino Kilo wants to counteract this problem through its sustainable concept. In one year, Vino Kilo was able to save 27 tons of clothing from waste. So, with their concept, they want to initiate a rethinking in the handling of clothing and fashion. What we know Kilo advocates is the second-hand fashion as a first-hand alternative. So give it a thought before you buy or throw a cloth as it may be useful for others and be a part in this recycling process also in a way contributing a bit to save our beautiful environment as a typical pair of jeans takes 900 gallons of water to make. On the other hand, a second hand denim takes zero. So hello, I have just recently visited this vintage kilo sale. I hope you find this video interesting. And so I'm back at home and I would like to tell you I like the concept but I did not buy anything but yeah there were so many people that actually bought from this vintage sale they actually liked it and they were enthusiastic to buy them 
some of the people were actually new to this concept like me and the others came on regular base when there is a winter sale. This was not a flea market but an exclusive winter sale. I would like to mention here that winter sale does not mean they are first hand, they are actually second hand and uh, but still the crowd was so enthusiastic to buy all this stuff because of this special touch of vintage. I hope you liked this video and if you did like it, do hit the like button. Also, if you didn't like it, do hit the dislike button. But yes, do hit one of them, either like or dislike. And also share it with your friends and family members. Do let them also know about this new concept of vintage sale if they don't know about it. And if you are new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell button so that you get the notification for my next video. And also keep following me on my Instagram and Facebook page Dreamcatcher Mira and on Twitter Dream Mira so that you keep update yourself with the stuff. See you in the next video. Till then, goodbye, dare to dream, travel to discover. Namaste.